AI has transformed content creation, particularly in video production, since 2021. The line between real and AI-generated videos is increasingly blurred, making it difficult to distinguish them. It's been said that the video you're watching now was created with a single prompt. And that's true. The three videos you just saw were each generated using one prompt, with no additional editing or voiceovers. Google's VO3 AI has revolutionized the AI-generated video market, potentially making it the most advanced AI video generator available today. Last year, OpenAI introduced Sora AI, and we also have Kling AI. But when comparing quality, accuracy, and video creation speed, I believe Google's VO3 stands out as the best. In this video, I'll demonstrate how to use VO3 to generate videos and evaluate whether it's worth the price. This is not a sponsored video, just my honest opinion. It's impossible to believe that just a few years ago, AI couldn't even make a proper walking video and just check it out now. It's incredible how far AI video technology has come since then. I created the video you're watching now with just a single prompt, showcasing the power of V3. Take a closer look, and you'll notice stunning details like water droplets on the camera and cinematic camera movements that rival high-budget movie studios. Remarkably, this video took only a few minutes to create using one detailed prompt. The prompt for this video was a paragraph, meticulously describing every aspect of the scene. Surprisingly, even a cooking video like this isn't real. It's AI-generated. We're not far from seeing entire AI-driven cooking YouTube channels. For another example, I used a simple prompt that included a specific audio track, like the distinct sizzle sound in this video. The key to great results with VO3 is crafting clear, detailed prompts. Now, let's dive in and create some videos to explore VO3's capabilities further. To start using V3, first search for it on Google and click the Try and Flow option. After selecting Create with Flow, sign up with your Google account to access the platform. While new accounts begin with zero credits, you can immediately claim 1,000 free credits by subscribing to their first month free trial. No payment required. I've already used my trial credits to generate several test videos. For our first experiment, I input a prompt describing a Viking longship sailing through icy waters while two brothers hide behind snow-covered rocks on the shore. The video generated successfully, though I noticed it lacks audio and the visual quality isn't quite as sharp as I'd hoped. Apart from that, I had written two brothers in the prompt, but it generated three brothers. So we can say, let's forgive the first mistake. This might be due to default settings or limitations of the free tier model. Let me clarify, this isn't a bad AI video at all. In fact, it's quite good considering we didn't provide extensive details and, more importantly, we used the previous V2 model instead of V3. That explains why the video lacks audio. To access the full capabilities of V3 with sound, here's what you need to do. First, select the Text to Video option. We'll cover the other features later. Then click the Settings icon. Here, you can choose how many outputs to generate. I'm selecting just one due to our limited credits. You'll notice we've been using V2 by default, which only costs 10 credits per video. Switching to V3 will cost 100 credits, but let's test if it's worth the upgrade. I'm using the same scene prompt and adding dialogue for one boy. They are coming. We need to get back to warn others, along with wind and wave sound effects. The video has now rendered. You can download it in various qualities. I'm choosing 720p, and we'll examine if the V3 upgrade delivers significantly better results. They are coming. We need to get back to warn others. While the current video output is visually impressive, it has more of a video game aesthetic than I wanted. To improve this, I'm going to refine our approach by using ChatGPT to create more detailed prompts. Here's the process. First, instruct ChatGPT to act as a prompt engineer and develop detailed prompts for video generation. 
when requesting your scene, provide specific elements. For example, a lone snowmobiler speeds across a frozen tundra in Alaska, chased by a black helicopter firing warning shots. The engine roars over the icy wind as shards of ice fly from the treads. The rider veers toward a frozen ravine, leaps the gap, and yells, You picked the wrong guy! As the helicopter struggles to keep up, include the chopping rotor blades, howling winds, and the high-pitched whine of the snowmobile engine. After receiving this detailed prompt from ChatGPT, I'll ask it to condense the information into a single, cohesive paragraph. This optimized version will then be ready to paste into our video generation tool. The refined prompt should produce higher quality results that better match our creative vision while working within the platform's guidelines. You picked the wrong guy! The video turned out great. Still, the results are impressive. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Since I only have 250 credits left, let's create something even cooler. Here's the next idea. 800 BC, Athens. A young Greek ruler speaks from marble steps to citizens assembled in the public square. I'll craft a detailed prompt for this, then add the dialogue separately for better control. Now I'm going to paste this prompt in VEO3 and add a dialogue at the end, which says, we are not real, we are just prompts. Do you agree? This method works well. Keeping dialogue separate from the main prompt helps maintain clarity. We are not real. We are just prompts. Do you agree? <laughs> this version is better. Now you understand how it works. Don't include the dialogue inside the detailed paragraph. Add it at the end, like I did. They also have a frames to video feature. You can upload images and turn them into a video. This is useful if you want to make a scene using the same characters and art style. I have two images, one of a red Ferrari and one of Iron Man from Avengers. I'll use them as the first and last frames. Let's make a video where the car turns into a robot. I'll use a detailed prompt I created with ChatGPT. I made two videos, but neither of them turned out how I expected. The problem is, this feature uses the V2 model, which is not as good as the V3 model. Next, there's a more advanced feature called Ingredients to Video. It lets you create short movies with the same characters. But there's a catch. It's only available for Ultra subscribers and costs $250 per month. Honestly, that's very expensive. Yes, the quality and accuracy are better than any other AI video tool out there, but the price is just too high. Would you pay $250 a month for this? I wouldn't. But if you're starting a business or a YouTube channel using AI videos, maybe you can think of it as an investment. The good news is, in a few weeks, other AI tools will support the V3 model too. In the end, I think this is the best AI video model in 2025 in terms of quality, speed, and accuracy. The only downside? The price. It's too high. That's it for today's video. I hope you found it helpful. See you in the next one.